What's up guys and welcome back to my channel. If you guys are new, make sure you guys go ahead and subscribe right now. And if you guys have already been a subscriber, welcome back. So today, as you guys have already read by the title, I am going to be making my kids Halloween baskets. They're not spooky baskets because nothing in here is spooky for them. You know how people say, oh, they're spooky baskets. No, I'm just gonna be making my kids some Halloween baskets. I love making them Halloween baskets, Easter baskets, Valentine's Day baskets, all types of stuff. I just want them to have the best time ever. I want to give them something just in case we don't go trick-or-treating and even if we do go trick-or-treating I'm still gonna give them this so I have everything right in front of me I'm gonna be showing you guys how I do each basket um now all the baskets are Everything's about the same. The only thing that's different is like they have different shirts um, or maybe a different book or a different coloring book or something like that. So every year is different. This is just how I'm doing it this year. And now my youngest daughter, Ayla, she is only one years old and she doesn't really walk yet or talk or anything, but I still got her something. It's not like a big basket like the other kids, but I still got her something. So if you guys are ready to, you know, watch the rest of this video, just go ahead and sit back, grab your popcorn and enjoy the rest of the video. All right guys, so as you guys can see, I have everything set in front of me. Um, some of the stuff that I got from Amazon, I will go ahead and link it in the description box down below. Um, some of the other stuff I just got from Target, and I don't know if they have like a specific link for it because Target doesn't sell Halloween all year long, but I'll tell you guys every like the place that I got everything from, and then we're just gonna be making the baskets. So I don't even know where to start. I guess the first thing to start is to show you guys the kids' Halloween baskets. Now this year they all got the same exact basket. Um, I really couldn't find anything cute and I just thought this one was super duper cute. It is fluffy and soft. It has like little sparkles on it. So all three of the kids got just this basket. I got this one from Amazon. So as you guys can see, I have this this one and then i have this one as well ayla is not going to get a halloween basket like i said in the intro but let me go ahead and show you guys what we got her first therefore because she's she only got a little bit of stuff so she got this which i also got this from amazon it says my first pumpkin even though she was born last year on the 26th of October, so technically her first Halloween was last year, but she was just a couple of days old, so she didn't really know anything. So we got this for Ayla, and as you open it up, there is actually some stuff inside of it. So let's go ahead and take it out. So these are just like little toys that make noise. Um, you can squish them, they're all stuck to the bottom. So we have like a little ghost, we have a spider, a cat. But yeah, we have these things that just go in here. There's also a candy corn that makes noise and you can just stuff them back which is cool and you just zip it so this is for Ayla we also got a little boat a little book that says little ghost with fun finger puppet she got a little small book because it fits her um, and then there's just like a little soft ghost on the inside where you can put your finger if you guys can see yeah so we got that for her as well and I'm pretty sure that's the only two things we got for Ayla so we're gonna put Ayla over to the side and now we're gonna start off by making the other kids this Halloween basket so let's go ahead and move everything so like I said here's their basket and I guess we can just go ahead and do this first they got some shirts from Target Target if you want to say we got some shirts, so we have a 5T for, this is, well, hold on, let me see. Okay, this one is for Kyrie. So we have this shirt here. We have this shirt here for Nova, which is the size 4T. We also have this one here for Nova. I don't know which one I'm gonna put in her basket yet. So I got her two. And then we also got this one here for DJ, which this one is really cool because if you see, it's like a pillow. So right now it's white and you can make it to where it becomes orange and green, okay, and purple. Oh wow, I didn't know it came with all these colors. So now the shirt looks like this. Well this, this looks even better. Okay, so I like this. So we're gonna take the hangers off um, and let's see which one. Maybe we'll do the black one for Nova since Kyrie has an orange one. It only makes sense that they all get a different color. So Kyrie, we're just gonna go ahead, fold that up. I'm just gonna place them in front of me because I'm not exact sure how everything's gonna go ahead and go inside of the basket yet. So we're gonna place all of their stuff in front of me. Next up, we got some glow in the dark bracelets from the Dollar Tree. We have this one, they each got a different one. We have this one, which is probably for Nova since it's like a more pinkish. 
So we'll put that in front of Nova. And then we have a ghost one like this. So we'll give Kyrie the ghost. And we'll give DJ the, what is this, a skeleton? Maybe a skeleton? I think that's what it is. <laughs> we'll give him that. Also from the Dollar Tree, we got this cute little pumpkin candy corn looking thing. So we'll go ahead, put that there. Next up, guys, we got them some books. So we have different books right here. I love getting them books for every, every holiday. I like getting them a book that represents the holiday. So for example, if it's Valentine's Day, I like to get them a book that represents Valentine's Day. Um, it's just a fun way to kind of add to your collection and make it more fun. So we have three books. So we're gonna give this one right here to Nova. It's just a book like this and these little things move. Do you see this? Watch this right here. It just moves and then they have other ones that move on the inside of the book. We'll give that one to Nova. This one that says Boo, a book of spooky surprise. We're gonna go ahead and give this one to Mr. DJ. And then we have this one, which is a Halloween party that looks really fun. We're gonna go ahead and give this book to Kyrie. Next up, we got some cups off of Amazon. I just typed in like Halloween cups, I think, or something like that, but I will list it down below. Therefore, you guys can go ahead and have it. So we have this cup right here. We also have this one. It looks like this. We have this one, this one looks crazy. <laughs> we have this cup, and then they actually came with four cups, and then we have this cup. So we only need to pick three of the cups, which I'll probably, this one will be for Nova. We'll have this one for DJ. And then maybe we'll give Kyrie this one. We'll give Kyrie that one. And then next up, we also got some coloring books, which I did get off of Amazon as well. Just typing like Halloween coloring books for kids or something like that. And this looks like it is a Paw Patrol. We got Paw Patrol coloring book like that. We had a Peanuts coloring book that looks like that. We have, ooh, a Star Wars coloring book that looks like that. Let's go ahead and open this one up. So I don't know if it's really Halloween, but I guess there's like some Halloween pictures inside of here. We also got a Mickey Mouse Clubhouse coloring book. Ooh, a little pony coloring book. That one is definitely for Nova. And then we got Jumbo Despicable Me. And then last but not least, we have Sesame Street. So since we have so many coloring books, I'll probably give them two each, which I'll give Nova the Sesame Street and the Little Pony. We will give Kyrie Despicable Me and Mickey Mouse. And then we're gonna go ahead and give DJ Star Wars and Paw Patrol. So we'll give them these two right here. So we're just gonna go ahead and leave the penis one out just as an extra book. We could probably use this one for next year. Moving on, we have like these little slap on bracelets. Originally, these were supposed to be for the kids' um, party bags. If you guys watched that video, thank you. If you haven't watched it, go ahead and go watch it after you're done watching this one. I made the kids' class some party bags and these were too big to fit in. So we're just gonna give the kids each a slap on bracelet. You just kind of like do that and then the bracelet slaps on. So we're gonna give Nova a purple one. We'll give both DJ and Kyrie a blue one and we'll save the rest for next year or something else, we'll save these. So now moving on from Target, I got them each a little stuffed animal bear looking thing. It's not a bear, it's like a dog. Let me see what it says. This is a Calavera dog, I think that's how you say it. So I got orange for DJ and Kyrie and then Nova got a little pink one that looks like this. So we got that, and then we also got them just some Sour Punch Halloween candy. We got them some candy because you can't miss out on the candy. So we got, oh, these are all messed up, okay. So we got that, and then last but not least, we got um, them a cover, which they all got the same cover, that's why I only brought one out, but I'll show you what they look like. So it looks like this. This is what the cover came to look like. Now I can pop up a picture on the screen to show you guys exactly what it looks like opened up. But this is a 50 by 60 and it glows in the dark. And like I said, they each got the same cover because my kids love to fight over covers. So now that they have three, they can't fight because y'all all got the same cover. <laughs> so we have that. Obviously the cover's not gonna fit in the bag. Everything else we're gonna try to fit inside of the little basket thing. Um, I didn't get them candy except for the sour punch things. 
only because like I said, trick or treating is on Halloween and I don't know if we're going or not, but if we do, they're gonna get a whole bunch of candy. So I'd rather give them other stuff that they can enjoy like doing like coloring or playing with or something in that nature. So we're gonna go ahead and do Miss Nova's first. I don't know if everything's gonna fit in here, but we are gonna try our best to see what does fit in here. So we're gonna wrap the coloring books around like this, if you can see, but I'm actually gonna put the pony one in the front because yeah. We're gonna put the pony one in the front. Obviously the book may not fit in here, but we're gonna go ahead and wrap our shirt and put it at the bottom. Therefore, I mean, it's like the smallest thing, so it's the easiest to fit. We'll go ahead and get, oh, they have a cup too, I forgot. Okay, we'll just get this, the little candy, and we'll place it in here like this, along with the glow in the dark bracelet. If you guys can see, it's starting to look like that. We actually turn it to where it's faces. All right, so now we're going to add the bracelet. We'll add this little candy. And then I think the last thing we could add is the cup that kind of looks like this. And therefore the dog, the stuffed animal, or this is a cat. This is a cat. No, we got a cat, DJ Carter got a dog. So we'll leave this out and then we'll leave also the book out because the book won't fit either. So we'll have like this set up like this. We'll, we'll try and maybe put him on top. I gotta set it up the day up. We'll set him up and then we'll have the book kind of out to the side or in the middle, something like this. You guys get the concept. <laughs> okay, so yeah, this is what it's going to look like. So we got Nova's done. Go ahead and put it down. I'll show you the basket. This is what it looks like. Let me get up close and personal. So here is Nova's finish basket as you guys can see it just has some like little fun stuff in it Just so they can enjoy like when they wake up in the morning It'll already be set out on the counter. So here is the first basket. All right So now we're just gonna make DJ and Kyrie's basket. Um, it's basically all the same thing We're just gonna go ahead and do DJ's now. We're gonna get DJ's books This is also how I can tell who's is who's by the color books. That's good. So we'll get his book, and then we'll need to get his shirt and put it down in there. Then we're gonna get his candy, his glow-in-the-dark bracelet. We'll get this candy, this other bracelet, and then his cup. So just like that, simple, easy. Now we just have to go ahead and do Kyrie's basket, and we're all set and done. Okay, so now Kyrie's, <clears throat> we'll put the Despicable Me in the front. So we'll set Kyrie's up like this if it cooperates with me. Okay, and then we're gonna get his candy. Oh, we got, forgot a shirt. See, moving too fast. We got a shirt. We have his candy, his glow in the dark bracelets, his other bracelet, this other candy, and then his. Cut, which Kyrie's shirt is a little bit bigger because it's a long sleeve. So just like that, you guys see? And then the dog and the books will go on the side. So let me bring all of the baskets in front of me so you guys can see. So this is what the Halloween baskets look like. I know this video was super short. Um, I just wanted to come on here and show you guys what I do just to kind of give you guys a clue, an idea of something that you want to do in the future. Or if you didn't know what to do, this is some super cheap, easy, everything here is cheap. I went to the Dollar Tree, I was Amazon, and then last but not least I went to Target so everything is right in front of you um, and it doesn't have to be this you can add whatever you want if you want to add more candy you can add more candy if you want to take away something you can take away you can add you can do whatever you want to do it's the world is yours and that's that so yeah hopefully you guys enjoyed this quick little video of me kind of rambling and talking and just showing you guys my kids' Halloween baskets if you did, please make sure to give this video a fat thumbs up and don't forget to subscribe to my channel and also turn your notifications on. Therefore, you guys do not miss an upload next time your girl posts. But until next time, I am going to see you guys later. I am out. Bye.